What's up guys? Welcome back to Brand Eats Heat with me, Brent Underwood. So before we start today's video, which is going to be a habanero, and I'll explain more about this particular pepper here in a second, but I just want to get something out there, um, and it's not a big deal. Uh, someone was trying to juice me up in the comments. It's a friend of mine, and like I said, it's not a big deal. I just want to clarify what this channel is for me. Um, so when I started the channel, I didn't start this channel to impress anybody. I started this channel to challenge myself, not just by eating hot stuff, by building up the courage, but by building up the courage to actually do it in the first place. It's something I had wanted to do for a while and I, you know, I was scared. I didn't know how to get started in doing it, and one day I just said, today's the day, I'm doing it. Win, lose, or draw, I'm, I'm, uh, we're going to get it done. So, now, that's what this channel is. That's how this channel started. This channel will always be about that, me challenging myself. Now, the mission here recently has been to get to super hot pods. And, you know, um, I started by eating a, jalap or a jalapeno. Then I wanted to move up to like maybe a serrano or a habanero. And eventually get to Carolina Reaper status. Or super hot pods, ghost, naga, Carolina Reaper, dragon's breath. To me, those are the super hot pods I want to get to eventually. But I'm not just going to dive in head first and start with Carolina Reapers. No, sir. I'm going to challenge myself and build up to it. So that when I get to this point, it won't be that big of a deal. That's what I chose to do. That's what I'm going to do. And nobody's going to juice me up to doing anything other than that. So, now, to this particular pepper here. It's been in question ever since it was given to me. Um, my buddy Connor, as you most of y'all know, was going to give me this habanero. I got to looking at it and started questioning whether it was a habanero or not. After four straight days of interrogating this guy at work... <laughs> I'm still not 100% sure that it's a habanero, but I'm quite certain that he believes it's a habanero, and that's good enough for me. So, now that that's out of the way, I am going to cut this in half, look at the inside of it, show you guys the inside of it, and go from there. I think if it was a naga, it would have a little uh, scorpion tail or some kind of little tail like the super hot peppers have. So, it's a really nice looking pepper. Make sure y'all can see it. I mean, it's a super awesome looking pepper. So, I'm just going to cut this sucker right down the middle, and we're going to see what we got. And after smelling it, I'm quite certain it's a habanero now. But that doesn't mean this is going to be easy. I do eat super hot stuff on this channel. Peppers is a different beast, though. It's a different ball game. It's a different dimension. And this is 
the road to building my heat, to building my tolerance. Um, and from the videos I've been watching of Johnny Scoville here lately, I could do, I could start out with doing one habanero until eventually I get used to that tolerance. Then I can up the habaneros to build my tolerance, even though I don't have no super hots right at the moment. And I'm in no way, shape, or form ready for them either. So, Brenny Seat. Not bad at all. So I'm 100% convinced that this is a habanero. <clears throat> Connor, thank you. Sorry I doubted you. I told Connor at work uh, before I left, I said, hey man, have you ever seen the movie Taken? <laughs> and he said, no. He's a younger... He's a younger guy. Uh, and I said, oh, okay. Well, hey, I just want you to know that pepper you gave me, if it's not a habanero, you know, I just want you to know that I have a particular set of skills and I will find you. <laughs> he just kind of looked at me weird. My heat's probably at a, you know, it's weird to say it. I thought it was going to be a lot worse. My heat set like... If I said it was at a 2, I'd, I'd be lying. My heat's probably at like just under a 2. Maybe a 1.5. Alright, we're going to get this other half of this pepper in. Or down. That's so weird, man. I thought this was going to be a lot hotter. Uh, you know, maybe I've secretly been building a tolerance through this channel doing these Inferno Candy Company products. And, you know, this stuff. I, I just thought eating peppers was a lot more brutal than this type of stuff. But maybe, maybe I was wrong, you know? <sighs> If you're not subscribed to the channel, I'd really appreciate your subscription. And if you like today's video, please hit that like button. Very good, fruity, floral flavor. Connor, if you're watching, thank you for the habanero. If you got any more, I'm trying to build my tolerance. <clears throat> I'll take every last one you got or every what last one that you can give me. I'll definitely take it. <laughs> Not bad. I, I, I seriously underestimated my tolerance, I guess. Uh, that doesn't mean I'm going to go jump off the high dive right now head first with these but I'll jump off the low dive a couple times you know get comfortable and then you know do do a couple swan dives off the low dive <laughs> and then I might go up to the top high dive and just jump in or you know, 
I'm going to get my feet wet before I just dive head first into it. <clears throat> so that second half of that pepper I just ate seems to be just a little bit warmer than the first half. But still, very manageable. Very manageable. I like it. Good deal. Well, guys, if you've enjoyed today's video, please hit that like button. And if you're not subscribed to the channel, I'd really appreciate your subscription. And until next time, I love each and every one of you.